Wow, hello everyone and welcome to Life of Wonders, welcome to my channel, this is Polo and I'm super happy to be uh, sharing with you a whole new video. Uh, today I thought I would line up all the Barbie extra dolls I have from series uh, 1 and series 2, uh, from number 1 to number 8, including the two Barbie extras that were part of the deluxe release and the playset, which I love. And uh, so you could have a panoramic view of all of them um, side by side in order. And um, I'm not going to rank them as such, just um, today is just an appreciation um, of all of them all together. Uh, Barbie Extra is my favorite line uh, so far um, that I can point out from the last few years, although I'm loving Barbie Licks as well. Um, but I need more dolls uh, from that line Um and I will be unboxing and reviewing um, every single one as well. Uh, but for now, uh, focusing on Barbie Extra, I think it's such a really cool uh, line for both uh, Playline and collectors alike. I would say they're pretty collectible and then they are uh, they have like a really nice price and uh, for a Playline too. And um, just about all right articulation as well for both playline and collectors um they don't have made to move bodies they have this semi-articulated bodies in my opinion is like the one that i like most i don't know just because it looks really cool um in the pictures and it, it you cannot see as many hinges and such as 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 you can with the made to move body which i also like but um in a different way <laughs> so i will get closer and uh so you can appreciate all of them from barbie extra number one the number uh oh yeah so i don't think i i did it in order number two and number three i'm sorry about that um and then number four number five number six um number seven eight and then deluxe and playset barbie extra and i was just watching a uh, the last video from marina the night is barbie the other day she's wonderful and she was explaining and bringing up the topic of the numbers and uh, and explaining the the reason behind it and i was guessing something uh, I was, uh, yeah, towards those lines, but she was clarifying and that was super cool. So basically every single doll from this line and uh, fashionistas lines um, can be Barbie. Um, so, I mean, of course, we have different characters if we focus on um, Barbie Dreamhouse adventures like Nikki, Renee, Daisy, Teresa. But, um, but when it comes with these releases... Um, they can just represent whatever the buyer wants to wants them to be and represent for um, a, a specific scenario. I mean, it could be like in a playline situation or it could be more personal. <laughs> but um, yeah, I'm loving this line. I think that um, um, they have put together a few of the things that um, needed to be... Um, um, together within the same line and um, for a long time uh, both um, uh, collectors and Barbie um, co doll collectors and Barbie lovers alike have been asking for and um, they don't have the made to move body but they have in my opinion what is like the um, uh, the most elegant body to me uh, which is a semi-articulated one so it doesn't it doesn't have as many hinges and, and such and so for pictures is great though i also like the uh, made to move one uh but just in a different way i'm loving all the extra accessories as well like the jewelry um and that they wanted to go a little bit like edgy um with the um concept art that then it was really nicely executed now that I see them all together, I'm even falling in love more um, than when I look at them individually. I think they make like a really nice collection and um, I would totally encourage you to go 
and grab your favorite and maybe from there um you will have like the feeling to collect them all um they're super cool seriously um we can find um different ethnicities uh we can find um different body types definitely so many different hairs uh hairdos um my favorite being quite possible well, my favorite barbie i have to say it is going to be barbie extra number one i think she's so iconic and when we were um given um the first barbie extras um this was like the one uh that was just um i don't know it was standing out a little bit i of course like barbie extra number three as well um, especially the creamed hair that takes me back to the 90s. Barbie Extra number four was my second, uh, is my second favorite probably, or I don't know, I'm in between number four and number eight right now, which I also like very much. And, and then, I don't know, it would be hard for me to rank. Of course, I can do that. Um, but first, I would love to see and to know, uh, which one, um, is your favorite, which one you will change or if you are looking forward for series three i am definitely looking forward for that um and anyway i hope you've enjoyed uh seeing all the barbie extra uh dolls together and um um and if you have enjoyed it uh please give me a like and stay tuned for more um and for now i hope you all stay safe and i'll see you all very soon bye bye